So denials are used to deny false power. We use them to not um, to eradicate the power we give to things that are not true. So what is not true? Lack, right? <coughs> Unworthiness, um, undeservedness, um, poverty. Um, all these kinds of things are not true, but so often in our human experience, we give these things weight and we act as though they are the truth of who we are and that they are the truth of our experience. So denials counter that belief and denials also deny the existence that things like that even have any weight at all that they matter. In fact, in Unity, we have this wonderful statement where we say that we return them, that negativity, that old consciousness of limitation and false belief, back into the nothingness from which it came. And don't you just love that? I send it back into the nothingness from which it came. I find a lot of excitement in saying that. So I just want you to really feel that. Think of something that you hold in your mind as a negative energy or a negative belief. Does everybody have one? Can you just think of one, right? And it might be about yourself or a person, a relationship, a situation. And imagine that if you were standing on the top of a hill, let's say a mountain, and you had that thing in your hand and you could send it back into the nothingness from which it came, you would feel the power of knowing that this thing that you've given energy and credence was never nothing anyway. It is not the truth. It is not the truth. And in unity, we make the distinction between truth and and what we call experience. So if I have an experience of lack, I'm not going to deny that I had the experience. I know what that felt like. I had something and now I don't. Okay, maybe a relationship ended or a job ended or something that I thought was mine is no longer mine. So I have the experience, but the truth the truth is not the lack. The truth means that I go higher. And so in that experience, I would say there is no lack. So if it's the end of, let's say, a relationship, I would say that um, I would say so-and-so is not my source of love. God is. 